How y'all doing today? This is my solar backup, um, my solar backup panel uh, for my house and my shop. Um, this is, this is, let's see here y'all, this is two 135 watt um, Kyocera panels. They are 270 watts total. And there's my ground cable. I'm going to get you a little closer up on there. There's my ground cable. Coming down. Let's see here. This is my combiner box. My midnight solar combiner box. My lightning arrestor. My conduit. My ground rod. And here on the outside. I got my ground rod coming out. Ground wire coming out. And there is my ground cable. It's about four foot into the ground. Okay. That's all six gauge copper cable. And there's my combiner box where I got my two panels in there wired up. I got number one and two panels. Alright, let's go here. And here they are in action. Oh yeah, and they're pointing to the south. They do a real good job. Real good job. Let me take you inside that you see the system. And here's how I got them hooked up to the roof. Ground wires. Okay, let's go inside the shop. All right, here we go. That's why the back I got drying. This is January, excuse me, February the fourth. That's a solar fan I got operating there. Kind of dark in here, y'all. Sorry about that. That's doing a heck of a job. Okay, y'all. Here is my solar system. Okay, that is a midnight solar combiner box, Morning Star uh, solar charge controller Pro 30, and this is my Magnus Sign inverter. That is one bad inverter. Got an automatic charger. Uh, like I said, I got all my ground wires and everything hooked to it. And here is the inverter remote. Tells you everything that's going on here. Let me see here zoom in a little bit. I'll turn her on. And you hear the little whoop. That's it coming on. It's pure sound wave y'all. Same thing as the power companies. And it's searching because I don't have it wired up yet. Um, um, waiting on my electrician buddy. We're going to wire it to the house and wire up receptacles out here to the shop. Have it all done by code. But this is my backup system. When the power goes out. So, yeah, I've been doing a lot of research and on YouTube and everything else. And a lot of good old boys in there got some good videos on solar. And I've been doing a lot of research for months, actually years. I finally got her hooked up. And here's my battery bank. I got one battery right there laying underneath the box. It's in a, uh, it's an AGM battery. That's one of them. I got four all together. And there's a 300 amp breaker coming from my batteries, just for safety precaution. And here is my batteries. They're all in parallel. Uh, all in parallel. Universal batteries, AGM. And here's a Delco, my old total motor battery. That's working just fine. It's got the green light in there. She is a beast. Uh, they're all 27 series batteries. 90 amp hours a piece. So all together I got 280 amp hours. Oh yeah. Looking good. You can hear that little clicking noise. That's inverter and the and the sine wave inverter doing its thing. And it's searching and all that good stuff. 
Let me see. Get butter up on here. Alright. And we go from there. Magna sign, Madam of Rudder. Madam B by Madam Energy. Alright, here's uh, what she looks like. Again. And the light's blinking on off the LED light because it's look searching for power, but I don't have it hooked up yet. Alright. Here's my midnight solar combiner box, y'all. I highly recommend this when you're doing a solar system. And it's got my 250 amp shut, shut off, main breaker shut off, or shut the inverter off, the batteries, everything. And right there, you got the solar PV control output one in, um, and PV input one. And over here is for your um, solar charge controller and your power going to your batteries from the solar charge controller. Okay, here's what it looks like inside. All right. Let me turn the camera that way, but here's everything. All the breakers. The whole nine yards. Pretty simple. We need the diagram. It's got a diagram right here. Right here. That tells you how to hook up everything. But yeah, it's, it's awesome. I got this from Alternate Energy. Everything here. My panels. Everything. A good store to do. Alternate, alternate Energy is a good store. Good stuff. They help you out a lot. Here's all my ground wires and everything. Here's my Midnight Solar. Uh, my Midnight Solar uh, ProStar 30, um, Pro 30 Solar Charge Controller. 14.3 volts. That's the amp. 3.5 is, is going. It's, like I say, it's 10 o'clock in the morning. Well, I mean, well, I'm at 10.50, excuse me. 4.3, 3.5 is it's jumping around a little bit. 3.5 amps. Now it's going back to the volts. 14.3 volts. And climbing. Yeah, it's a good unit, y'all. I love it. Well, hey, y'all, have a good one, and thank you for watching my solar backup power system for my house and my shop. It's 2,000 watts all together. Well, anyway, and here's here's my backup. You got to have a backup when you have a, or you should when you have a solar backup system. In case your batteries ever go low. Oh, let me see here. In case your batteries ever go low, this is where you use to charge my batteries with. Because it's got an automatic inverter charger on it. Okay, well, here we go. Turn the choke on. That's a 2000 watt Honda EUI 2000i, 2010 model. Made for uh, ethanol and all that good stuff they put in the gas nowadays. But this is for backups. Hmm. All right, one second, y'all. Oh, we got to turn it on. Okay. I had a brain cramp there, y'all. Now I'm going to crank one crank. Now there she is. That's what I used to charge my batteries up with. And let me put her on the eco throttle. Well, first I'll cut the choke off. Alright, here's the eco throttle. It's loud, isn't it? I got that from Taylor Forbes here in Virginia. Out of Farmville, Virginia. A good company. Need a good generator, that's the place to get one. Alright, y'all, y'all have a good one. That's what they use the charging battery system up with. Like I say, it has an automatic charger. And I just use that at night or whatever if I need to. And it'll only run for a couple hours. This little unit runs. 15 hours on one gallon of gas. Okay, y'all, have a good one. Thank you for watching. All right, y'all. Bye-bye.